no idea. So we're going to find out. Yeah, we're going to see. Will it press? <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of The Yard. It has been a hot minute since we have been back with you. And speaking of hot, summertime is kicking in here in North Dakota and we have some awesome grilling designs coming you guys way today. Sasha, do you wanna tell us what we're gonna be working with and what we're pressing on? Yeah, so Caesar has launched a new product. It's gonna be the Caesar Matte. So it's Caesar Easy Weed Matte. Uh, we've got all the wonderful colors here, but again, this is the adhesive side, so it's going to be a little bit brighter mm -hmm. on the actual side that you're going to see. This. And we have our aprons here that we got from heattransferclothing.com, so we'll put the link down below so you guys can check that out. And then we just picked up the oven mitt and pot holder at just like your local store. I mean, department store would have them for you. We're going to hop into it, so we're going to move this stuff aside so we can start weeding all of our lovely designs. Yeah. Okay. All right, for my design today, I kind of have a little red, white, and blue theme because the 4th of July is coming up and just summertime, America, awesome. So I have the new matte royal blue, the new matte red, and then as well as just regular Easy Weed white because that already looks matte, so it's going to be perfect together. Oh, yeah. And then I decided to utilize all the colors. <laughs> all right, let's get started. And when you guys are cutting too, we use all the same cut settings that you would if you're cutting regular Easy Weed, so there's no difference on that either. So something I always like to do because I am somebody that likes to not be wasteful when I'm using material is I mash a lot of things together. So I ganged a bunch of stuff together here. So these are three different designs I put in one little piece. So like these ones are going to make a circle, so I do have to cut them out and place them that way. But I love ganging kind of stuff up like this because then you can maximize what you're using of the material. Yeah. Oh, 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 I went <laughs> wrong the wrong way. way. Wrong way. Which is, that's okay. So that's something interesting to talk yeah. about too is sometimes the way you weed, like just the direction can change how quickly you're going to weed something. So it's interesting. Yeah, you tried to weed it the yeah. one way and then you're like, oh no, this other way is like, boom, you just whip through it. Yep. And then it was just so nice. You just have to be Boy, conscious of how your design goes. Should we do the aprons first? Sure. Because we might have to test the pressure. Do you want to hand me my apron? <gasps> Please. I mean, I will. I'll allow it. Just pay for putting this. I was hoping, <laughs> hoping I didn't have to hostage pay a ransom. <laughs> hostage. Hold it hostage. <laughs> I can't grill anyway, so I don't really know what I'm doing. What's grilling? Can you grill? I've never grilled. I've never done it. I've never grilled. Because I've never had a I grill. I want to really bad. <laughs> But like, <laughs> <laughs> Nick's dying in the back, by the way. I would love to learn. Can it you, just oh. scares me. Undercooking meat just scares me. Since this does have seams on the side, I am a little concerned about pressing, especially mm. with our designs being a little close to them. So I'm going to use a handy dandy Teflon pillow to press these. It's a good idea. So I'm going to test my pressure here because I know I'm going to probably have to adjust it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> And we're pressing at 305, just like normal Easy Weed that you guys always use. Uh, one thing that's really cool about my design is I can actually press all of this at once. You just have to be careful where the liner is. So I just cut very close to the design so I can press all of this at once. 10 second press. <laughs> <laughs> and we're going to do a hot peel, so immediately. One. Boom! That's all she wrote. I'm press yours Beautiful. now. Since Maggie's design cannot be pressed all at the same time, I'm going to do the one second pack. That. And we're going to do hot peel. Nice. Yes. All right, now she's going to press for the full time. Yes, I am. <gasps> Ooh, do you want to showcase it? Yeah. I'll Ooh, oh, no, I don't know if my melon will fit in there. Oh, yeah, well. <laughs> of course Oh, I'm will. too short now. So. Oh, no. Oh, gosh. <laughs> okay. Choices have been made. Potholder one. What do I want to do? I think Ooh. I want to do flipping. 
Awesome. Yeah. I have an idea of it going this <gasps> way. Yes. Oh, uh, one thing before you do that. What? I'm gonna test the pressure for the pot holder. Oh, good idea. So because these do have a little bit of thickness to them, I'm gonna make sure that my pressure is gonna work with them. Oh yeah, that's good. That's good. I'm gonna do one second tack on this. Like that. This has a little bit of a texture, so we're gonna see it's how good. it Yeah, it's oh. gonna be interesting. <sighs> it's a little up there, but yep. I think once we do the, the second one. Yeah, once we do the second one, we'll be I think we'll be golden. Also, this can layer too. I see oh, that yeah. you layered on it. I did layer, I forgot. Yeah. So you can layer this just like with normal easy weed. So that's really, really nice too when you're doing this kind of kind of cool stuff. Now I'm gonna do the full tap. And we probably sound like a broken record, but we don't need to use a Teflon sheet because we have a Teflon cover. Yes. <gasps> it's beautiful. I say it like every single time. Every single time. <laughs> well, it's just so handy because you don't have to worry about mm -hmm. it. It really is. Oh, it, yeah. yeah it's, nice. it's like, how, I love how like we talked about with the red on yours. It's I like, know. It's like burgundy right now. It'll turn <laughs> red. It'll be like normal yeah. color. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You're flipping it around. Yeah. It's a little different. <laughs> All right. We'll let that cool. Like just like lift it pew, off. Pew, pew. Like I didn't even have to peel it off. It just lifted. Cute. That's show the cute. show the world. Yeah. Look at it. That's pretty actually cool. it fit in there really nice. That's pretty cool. I'm actually kind of shocked. <laughs> oh yeah, absolutely. It's super nice how it's all formed in there. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Okay. Cool. All right, no idea. So we're gonna find out. Yeah, we're gonna see. Will it press? <laughs> oh <bunch>. yeah. <laughs> she thick. Yeah, she thick. So one thing that's really nice about Easy Weed is it can press on a lot of really unique things, which I would say this is extremely unique. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thanks, Maggie, for trimming these up. No prob. Full time. You are. Oh. oh nope. Oh, oh, oh. I might have to do, yep, that one. I might have to try to press that a little bit more. So we're going to try a pillow because some of it's stuck, but it is there's coming little, up a little bit. Yeah, there's little chunks. An interesting pressing experiment. Don't learn today. Yeah. I don't want to press it too long because I'm scared about that. Yeah. Oh my gosh, yeah, that was oh, so much better. Yeah. So in order, because this is so thick and it does already have like layers to it. It's got a cushion to it. It's got the texture to it. It's this vinyl is you really have to kind of fight with it. So uh, this little Teflon pillow is so nice because you can just like pop it right in there. I'm just lining up my designs here because I think with her kind of mitt. I'm going to try to do it just one single press and see uh, what happens. <laughs> Here we go. That's scary. I don't know why I just like flinched when you closed it. Like, <laughs> I'm a flincher though. Jump scare? Yeah. Just kidding. Boom. Ooh. Hey. Oh my gosh. Hey. Are you kidding? Wow. That was like, wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. Yeah, wow. Crushed it. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Like this. Slow or okay. fast? Ooh, my so kind of wrapping up and going over what we did today, we used the Caesar Easy Weed Mat. And we use it in a bunch of different ways. So we have it on our aprons. We use it on a pot holder oven mitt and as you guys can see it has such a nice matte finish it worked so well with everything having that one second tack is perfect because mm -hmm. you get time and you get time to really work with it so if that because of the texture it didn't press perfectly you get a little bit more wiggle room to keep working with it and making sure it looks perfect 
One thing that we ran into is we needed, well, I needed hers turned out perfect without it. This oven mitt was a little bit thicker, so we did end up using a Teflon pillow, as well as we used a Teflon pillow on the aprons, but it really is perfect for when you have those difficult seams that are getting in your way. Yeah, and yours had like a texture to it too, yeah. and it was really, really heavy. Mine was, mine feels like a cloth, a little bit thinner so I think that's where it worked a little bit more in my favor yeah, absolutely so, since Maggie and I have just been working with Matt we do have a comparison for you right you here holy crap yeah sorry can I say that holy guacamole <laughs> oh uh, so this side is the matte side and then this is regular easy weed on this side and you can definitely tell a difference wow. with the red so now we have our designs all together. We're ready. This is a great way to decorate anything that you're using in your kitchen or your grill. Great Father's Day gifts, ideas, you know, all that mm -hmm. stuff. Uh, I just, I love this product. It's one of my favorites just because it's easy to work with. It's got that matte finish to it and just a nice way to accent just things around your kitchen and for grilling. All right. Thank you guys so much for joining us today. We hope to see you guys in the next episode of The Yard. Thanks, guys.